YouTube to catch up to me. Come on, phone. <laughs> Need my phone to stay with me here on this one. Okay, there we go. There we go. Everything is functioning as it should. It's all functioning. <laughs> the blue snowball likes me this time. I remembered water for the paintbrushes. And I have paint. <laughs> What's up, Black Emerald? <laughs> hey, what's up, Kit Cobb? It's been a minute. I'm doing good. Today has been a nice day. I spent all day cooking. <laughs> like, literally all day. I, I went, did some errands. I got home at like 11 a.m. and spent until about 4.30 p.m. in the kitchen, um, cooking like a billion different things and just cleaning the crap out of it. <laughs> And then I sat down and I was like, I have a stream soon, and I am dead now. <laughs> Thankfully today is the painting day, so I continue to make an absolute mess of my shirt, as now I go from flower on everything to paint. <laughs> it was nice though. Um, I have cherry pie that I'm making. Um, I made the filling earlier, and the dough is currently chilling in the fridge, so once I'm done here, I can go ahead and pop those in the oven before I go to bed. <laughs> I am very excited about that. <laughs> mm. But today we are painting, and well, let me get these tools somewhat closer to me. <laughs> Bless Kit. Honestly, I'm excited to paint. It's going to be a nice, chill way to end my day. Just, just paint some things. Although I have to, I have to show this now. Um, a, a big reason why painting is high up on the list here for things I need to do is one. Two, four, this is seven, eight, nine, and ten are already on the thing. Um, for Christmas one year, my family, like, collectively got me a bunch of art canvases, and I don't do, tra like, traditional art as it is that much, but I don't do painting ever, really. <laughs> so I was like, you know what, let's do that. So I bought a bunch of these really cheap Walmart acrylic paints you give to little kids. It was like a massive pack of them for like 15 bucks. I should take a picture of this before I ruin everything. Let me take a picture before I like, you know, destroy the setup. It's fun to do the before and afters. Why does my sewing machine look like it's on? <laughs> it is a lot of canvases. Some of them are small, some of them are just like square ones. And then, oh, I hope I didn't just, I did. I have to close and reopen YouTube now. <laughs> and some of them are like, I do not want YouTube music. I have to use my phone to look at the chat because the laptop is too far away. <laughs> okay, and where is me? Here we go. Me. Perfect. It's easier to read the chat when it's close to my face, but... <laughs> you know, that was like 15 bucks for like a billion of these in like every different color. There's like a couple things like it too. It was like a gemstone tone one and I just... I can't justify buying that much acrylic paints. I just got like the basic bitch colors pack and we're going from there. <laughs> so pretty much we're just gonna, we're gonna be doing a few paintings today because I have these, you know, these, these tiny ones I don't think will take too much time. And then we can also, we can move some of the bigger ones. I am saving some of the bigger ones for next week. Um, I won't go into what's going on next week, but we're going to be using them. <laughs> what's up, Flegel? How you doing? <laughs> To think to start off with, I think I'm gonna do it actually a little tiny humidity this time because I actually have a lot of the humidity colors. Let me put them here so I can share my findings as I get to them. Use this is a better color for the eyes. I don't want to do like bright for the eyes. I think I might mix some colors for the eyes. <laughs> this and the brown. Let's see, which of these looks like it could be taken out, tone-wise. Those? Oh man, it's gonna be... This, this, this is gonna be a trip. <laughs> what do I look like again? Hi, I forgot my own colors. I think we're gonna take that yellow out and replace it with gold, and I think it's gonna look neat. I am gonna have to mix these together. Yeah, I think I'll do it with like the gold eyes. Give it like a neat color palette. Ah, oh, shoot. 
the leggings. How am I gonna handle those? Purple we have is very strong. I could just not do like a full thing. I could just do like a closer upper one. Oh man, like choices. Painting has choices. I'm also terrified of spilling something. <laughs> There's a bunch of parchment paper all over um, my sewing table and then my laptop is like a very safe distance away. I usually would put the water like closer there, but I do- I just got this laptop. It costs like as much as a semester. I am not about to- <laughs> just spill water out of my laptop. So I guess we're all just- I want to do a jelly bean first. It's really hard to fuck up. Let's, let's do jelly bean first because it's really hard to goof up jelly bean. And then we'll get to the we'll get to the complexities later. I'm, I'm having brain power. We're, not, we're, we're using our brain thoughts right now. <laughs> yes. I love this laptop though. It's why I could use a model again when I do hand cam streams. Because this laptop actually has power. Although, it, it's still not happy about it. If I touch it, it is very warm. <laughs> Like there's no lag or anything. It, it's 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 power and all like a little champ. <laughs> I still don't know why the first day it was so. I, I don't know what was with that aspect ratio. I should have saved that stream. It was the funniest thing in the world. <laughs> okay, let's draw. Let's do a little jelly bean to get us started. And now you're thinking, Humidity, why do you keep making jelly beans? Because uh, one, I really wish I could have a cat, and I'm doing wish fulfillment. And two, it is literally a brown blob, and it's really hard to goof up when you're trying something new. <laughs> some people, like some actual artists out there, like to do like a layer of paint on their canvas first to like prime it. And I would totally, I totally consider doing that, and then I ran out of time, because I spent five hours cooking. To be fair though, Food was good. I had a stir fry. I made a stir fry. And it was tasty. Oh no. This. This pencil isn't good at erasing. Right, this, this canvas does not seem to want to forget, is a better way of putting it. Come on, canvas. Please forget. Please forget, Mr. Canvas. <laughs> I'm gonna keep sketching and just hope for the best. There you go. <laughs> Black Emerald, eat food! <laughs> food important! I made the stir fry. Stir fry was tasty. I also made a pasta salad because the pasta salad needed to be made. I cleaned up, I did like a, I did like five rounds of dishes, and then <laughs> after that I ended with the cherry pie that I mentioned. I don't have an I don't have like enough filling because I listen, listen, I made that with fresh cherries. Actually that's a question. That's a question. Why don't I make a poll on mobile? Can I make a poll on mobile? Okay, I have to do it on my computer. How many of you have seen a cherry, like actual fresh cherries, not the maraschino and like the cans, like actual like fresh cherries for sale in the supermarket before? I, I have to see something here. Just do the little wings. I'm trying to see if it's just me who's experiencing a thing or if it's like a, <laughs> yeah, like ones with like a stock, like, they picked it off the tree and then put it in the store. <laughs> okay, so it's just me then. I've literally never seen, never seen fresh cherries before, like in a store. It was my first time today and it was in like a low budget store too, which was weird to me. I was like, oh, how, how does this have it? But like my normal stores don't. <laughs> What's up, Black Teardrop? How you doing? <laughs> We are painting jelly bean. First, I gotta draw the jelly bean. There you go. Will this show up if I try to show it to the camera? Kind of does. Kind of does. I, I will one day figure out a setting that makes it easier for me to show the camera things, but like, here's a very faint jelly bean sketch. <laughs> 
The UK might be different. I asked Plum, but I'm very sure Plum is asleep. <laughs> We always have fun figuring out different, like, cultural things that the UK and the US have, like, it's always a fun time. We go, oh, you don't say this word? It's like, no, no, we do not. <laughs> Seasonal? I think they are. I don't know. I have to, like, I'm gonna, like, go back. I'm going back to that grocery store, first of all. Like, it was a lower budget grocery store. I, I did not have high hope. I just wanted to get an onion and some vegetable oil and came out like a thief. I had... I got corn cobs, so I could do corn on the cob. I got the cherries. I got a bunch of peppers for the pasta salad. I got rice and some more cereal, which are just, you know, standard things. I needed, I forgot to pull off a paper towel to put the lids on. I could go there now. <laughs> it is gonna be very difficult to not wipe my hands on my pants. These are my work pants for office job. I just went to the office this morning. <laughs> Oh, this got on me immediately. <laughs> Seasonal. Yeah, she might be asleep. She had a she had a big test today. I'm very proud of her. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what season cherries are. Okay, so I have a bunch of different cheap brushes from a couple of years ago. I forced all my friends to get together with me and paint sad clowns, and now I just have a bunch of extra dollars like. Amazon paint brushes from when I made everybody do that so using those <laughs> So like nothing about this is professional if these come out at all decent. I will genuinely be shocked <laughs> For now Can I pour this onto this paper plate? I Can't I can pour it onto the paper plate There is not much in these though. I will note that <laughs> See, I'm wearing, like, my undershirt. I took off my fancy shirts because fancy shirts, you know. I'm gonna move this over a tad. Here, close. Okay. Yeah, like, I took off the fancy shirt. The pants are, it's easier to hide, I guess, is the word I'm thinking of here. Let's begin painting our jelly beans. And my eyes are choosing right now to go out of focus. Love it. But we're going to paint a jelly bean and it's going to be very calm. I do like painting, I just don't do it very often. Which is, again, like my family gave me like a billion canvases. They're like, oh yeah, you, you, you do the art. Have, have Canva. <laughs> so I. I have many canvas. Okay, acrylic paint is really hard. And we're gonna go with this and we are gonna go with it. <laughs> I'm excited to eat more pasta salad after this while I get the cherry pies in the oven. Yeah, it's like I was gonna do like a, you know the McDonald's apple pies? Like the like slabs pretty much, like the little, like, like the hot pockets of pie that's my plan pretty much i'm gonna do like the hot pockets of pie but like with cherry pie although I've, apple pie is my favorite pie strong bias here i love apple pie this might turn out terrible but we're here for the fun of it I am planning on playing more Minecraft next week. I had a lot of fun with Minecraft yesterday. <laughs> yes, I absolutely adore apple pie. Um, I want to make more things with pears this upcoming year. We have a pear tree in the backyard and I do not do nearly enough with the pear tree. <laughs> What's up, Crooked Gamer? We are painting a jelly bean. And I think I'm gonna move that there so it's a little easier to see what I'm doing there we go now you can see me suck at painting more closely <laughs> now that is dangerous as hell I'm gonna pick this up and put it down like a responsible adult who can't afford to buy another laptop <laughs> Ooh, Nikki, goddess of victory. I have not heard of that. 
I just when I hear the, like Nikki in like a gaming sense, I just think about Love Nikki and how much money I spent on that game in high school, and I get slightly concerned for high school candy. <laughs> if you've never heard of Love Nikki, just just don't just don't look it up. It's a dress up gotcha game. Not a, it's not really gotcha either. It's just a pay to win dress up game basically. <laughs> it's very much just a pay to win dress up game. I spent a lot of money on it. That and Love Live, those those were my high school vices. I spent a lot of money on Love Nikki and Love Live. If it has love and microtransactions, I probably paid it. <laughs> so, let's try to make that have a bit more shape to it. Go here. Mike's a little low. Here, let me fix that. Do, 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 do. Thank you for telling me. <laughs> Here, I'll put it there for now. Should be good. There for now. Should be good. I'm also talking kind of quietly. I'm in like think mode. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. There we go. My favorite part of Love Nikki, though, was oh my god. At the time, it was like the world, it was world shattering for everyone. Um, the company who made it was Chinese and they changed the English localizations names to uh, the Chinese names, which makes sense. You know, they wanted to make it easier on like their development team or whatever, except the problem is that <laughs> um, some names do not translate better than others. Um, well, some, some names translated better than others. I can't talk. Um, I think her name was, like, Lily. I forget what her English name was, but they turned her name to Bobo. And, of course, um, most English speakers were, like, like, the clown, and nobody could take it seriously, and, like, everybody begged, like, please love Nikki, change it back. And <laughs> I actually looked into the game last year, I think, and they still had her name as Bobo. So they said, fuck you. Her name is gonna be Bobo. <laughs> Absolutely hilarious in hindsight. Trying to make this good. It's my own, that's my downfall here is I'm trying to make it look nice. <laughs> Bobo, 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 Bobo. God, I thought that was a fever dream for the longest time. Like, dead ass. I did not- I, I, I remember watching, like, an episode of that as a kid, and, like, thinking I just made it up in my head. Like, I could not find it. I didn't know what it was called. Like, I dead ass just thought that I, like, envisioned it as a child. Like, that was, like, my weird fever dream. The brown is coming out okay. It's only the first fight, but, like... Yeah, the brown's coming out okay. It's a start. I'm having a start. Getting our little victories in. Honestly, I need to play more games. Because, like, Cougar Gamer, you always come in here with, like, the coolest games, like, and I've just, like, I, I, I've never heard of them, and it makes me want to play them. I've just, I'm, I'm very uncultured. <laughs> I'm running out of paint. Bless. Bless, kid. If I can make him look nice, I'll put him on my wall. If he doesn't look nice, I will hide him in my closet because I, I can't bring myself to throw anything away that I've made. But then just like, I'll, I'll pretend he doesn't exist. But so far, I, he's, he's looking like he might go on the wall. <laughs> Victory. I like this like super thin brush. It's making it very easy for like what I'm trying to accomplish here. It's very thin and verticile. Let me fix this up a bit. He's looking a little 
ragged. <laughs> trying to find all the gems from the past. Oh man, I'm trying to think about what other games I played as a kid. <laughs> Let me fix up the face a bit too. Trying to make it like d dark because this is acrylic. This is little kid acrylic paint. It's not gonna go well on the first layer. <laughs> so let's darken it a bit. I would show you all my sad clown painting, but. I actually do not have it, the office where we did the clown painting. Um, they did not hold this as an event. I'll make that very clear. We just kind of showed up and was like, hey, Green is the office for this? And they're like, sure. And we painted sad clowns. And now in the basement, there, Shoji was there for that too. Like, there's our sad clowns. <laughs> <laughs> and it was very fun. I got like all of my best friends at the time and said, we're painting clowns. And then somehow miraculously everybody showed up, like nobody dropped out. <laughs> and we ate pizza and painted sack clowns for several hours. It was a really fun time. Like really just recommend if you want a like fun activity for you and your buddies, just like get them together. I was inspired by Brian David Gilbert and him making his friends paint sad clowns, and I can confirm it is indeed a fun activity. Okay, so this is getting dark now. What's up, John? How you doing? <laughs> yeah, so here's our kitty cat. Jellybean is getting some color now. We're getting there, you know, just bit by bit. <gasps> I'm gonna move this over a bit. Start the back here. I still have to get a couple bits with the brown, but I'm like making everything go a little darker first. That. That is as close as I think that's gonna get. Now let's do the back leg. Here we go. Painting is fun. I like painting. <laughs> I have to kind of like remind myself that, you know, other mediums of art can be fun. Although as, as we've all seen, I am a digital artist kid by like nature. <laughs> Try to Smooth some of this out. I am not a professional painter. <laughs> I have fifteen dollar Walmart paint and hope. Honestly, I'll give Walmart credit. Their craft section, like it's not you know high quality professional shit by any means, but like their stuff has been like more quality than I've expected when I go there for like crafts videos. Like, I'll go there and get, like, the model clay. I did not think the model clay would have any kind of goodness to it, but it was actually very solid. Okay. So here's that. And then I have this little bit here in the foot. Yes, cheap paint in a dream. <laughs> but there, that's our jelly bean so far. I am starting this portion here of the back. Sorry if I go quiet when I paint the complicated bits. <laughs> Bless y'all. This is this has been like very I, I'm glad I picked something simple, first of all. Like holy shit, I would have died painting, you know, Hemity right off the fucking bat, but like it's very fun. Just like painting painting our simple jelly bean. Jelly bean got done a little dirty with the model clay, so let's try to we're gonna try to redeem Jelly Bean here. We're gonna give him a second chance here, especially because you know we also lost Jelly Bean in Minecraft. 
two years, two fucking years, I finally find a cat, and then he mysteriously vanishes. Now, I don't know, I didn't see anything, like, I, at least, like, in, in the moment, I did not see any kind of a, hey, you know, your pet died notification, so I don't know what happened, but, like, apparently, you know, he lost Jelly Bean. <laughs> Oh no, I touched it a bit. Oh no. We can work around it. It's okay. We can work around it. Go back here. Do the back part again one more time. Keep it dark. There we go. And then this back part up here. Just a little love. Okay. It's part of the ear can as well. As well as this bit. There we go. It's like lovingly going around and fixing things. <laughs> Just turn up at some time randomly. <laughs> I mean, that's probably what's gonna happen. Like, I'll just be, you know, chilling out, and then bam, surprise, jelly beans next to me. I really think if I had to make an educated guess that isn't just, you know, I didn't notice the death notification, like. So here's the first part. Here's our jelly bean, the brown bits. Next, I need to rinse my paintbrush, and we're gonna do the black bits. Let me shut this. Yeah, these are honestly pretty good. There's 24 plus colors. And so far, they've been pretty decent. I'm sorry if you hear paintbrush ASMR. I don't think you will. It's pretty quiet, but like, I'm, I'm sorry if you hear the paintbrush ASMR. The water cup has to be over here. <laughs> you just... There we go. Okay, there we go. Bam. And now for our palette, let's get the black paint. I'm gonna immediately get black paint on myself because I tear at it like a fucking Neanderthal instead of where they actually provided me a place to tear at it because I am a Neanderthal. Let me get this to wipe my hands with. I should have opened these like before. <laughs> I didn't think to. Uh, I was. I thought enough ahead to like peel the plastic off some of these canvases, but like I did not think ahead enough to open the paint. <laughs> okay, so here's this. Come on. Come on, black paint. The black paint apparently needs coaxing. Why is it stuck? Oh, it looks solid almost. I have a chopstick. I stopped the chopstick. Oh, that's why. It was stuck. <laughs> I was correct. That there. <laughs> that that poor chopstick. I have taken it, it, it. Its original purpose was very much just to be for stuffing and I've used him for like everything now. Come on, get out. There we go. Okay, the black one. Um, a little harder to get out of the bottle. Can't get the lid back on with one hand. I'm gonna have to get more of these if I do more paint. There's not a lot of paint. <laughs> Universal usage chopstick, yes. I'm gonna try to wash it and see what goes, but like, my poor chopstick. Okay. Next up, I guess I'll start. I'm gonna do this swing because the rest of it's still kind of drying. It's a very nice black color. Very dark. Oh! Almost threw that on the floor. I did not throw it on the floor. Jesus. 
It's okay. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. I only almost threw paint all over the place. <laughs> Back to chill, we're back to chill. Painting a devil cat, and we are chill. And we didn't just almost threw things. What's up, Jonah? Welcome back. <laughs> we have gone from Minecraft. We are, today we are painting. It's very chill. <laughs> Looked right from heard accident noises. <laughs> There were accident noises. I almost, uh, the paper plate I have the paints on, I, I went to grab it and I accidentally, like, slapped it and it almost flipped over onto the wooden floor. Which, to be fair, wood floor, easier to clean than, like, a carpet. I actually, when we caught carpet done for the house, I vehemently refused to get carpet in here because I, I knew I was going to be doing stuff that would, I probably would prefer to have a hardwood floor for. Let's see. There you go. Trying so hard to make it nice. <laughs> Thank you, Cookie Gamer. Yes, I almost catapulted it. Actually, it, uh, not the wall. I, I, the way it's set up, it would have actually gotten my keyboard instead of my wall. So, Stabby would have been slappied. <laughs> I'd say make we'd be making Stabby colorful, but it is literally brown and black paint, so, like, not exactly the highest gamut there. There we go. The black is harder, almost. I, I don't know how to describe it, but it feels harder. <laughs> there we go. It smells interesting. Like, I don't know how to describe the smell of this paint. Bless Crooked Gamer, thank you. <laughs> Yes, this is our little shoulder buddy. If I do this, you can see him. This is Jelly Bean. <laughs> I want to catch, uh, in the, the, the I, I wanted to say it all cool and in character. I want an actual cat, but I can't have an actual cat. Jelly Bean is wishful for months. <laughs> I love my Jelly Bean. <laughs> Yep, just our just our standard jelly bean. <laughs> One day I'm gonna get an actual cat. Just just you wait. And then I'll become one of those annoying cat moms who like always talks about their cat. Hmm. Trying to trying to give this like sharper curvature. That's a bit better. There you go. We're getting somewhere. That's a wing. Looks like a wing. <laughs> I also have definitely gotten paint all over this parchment paper. I'm really glad I put the parchment paper down. <laughs> right, let's get wing number two. The black paint, uh, I'm probably gonna have to go over again, but so far does not seem to have as much of an issue with, like, with the leakage, or not the leakage, the, what is the word I am looking for here? The saturation, we're gonna go with saturation. <laughs> had to, like, stop and think about it. I'm trying to leave, like, white line art, almost, because I think it'd look neat. And how well I pull it off is just a matter of... Oh god, my eyes. Uh... My poor eyesight is what's really going to be the hard part here. <laughs> Do I want 
to do the line art for the wings? That is the question. Here we go. My, my, my think brain is on. I am going to re, I keep goofing up. <laughs> Here we go, we're just gonna just like aggressively throw some paint down. There we go. See no accidents here. No accidents at all. God help me with any more complicated design than just jelly bean because I don't know how I'm going to handle myself. This this paintbrush is starting to betray me a bit. <laughs> We're getting there, folks. Our cat's looking like a cat. <laughs> keep going you know it's like different styles of painting like gauche and like all kinds of fancy names for it. what do you call it when it's just like shitty $15 Walmart acrylic paint and a $1 canvas what do you call it then what is the name of that <laughs> like is how how can I call it something fancier than it is so I can feel better <laughs> Now the goal is just to fix the edges of the wings here. It's like they're, hmm. Better. That's the neat part, you don't. <laughs> I want to feel bougie. This isn't bougie at all. A little better. I, th I, I might go over with a white paint. Or actually, I don't know. I think I'll go over white paint like when everything is like super fucking dry. But for now, um, we have wings. Let's get this tail started. I am a fine artist making the highest quality painting. This is going way better than expected so far, though. Like, I expected this to be go to, like, to go terribly. I'll be real, like, I thought this was going to go awful. Go. Let's do this. Bam. This isn't the most creative painting in the universe, but darn it, it doesn't look like total trash. <laughs> God bless all the fine art students out there. I have to use like the, the cancer causing paints and stuff to make it last forever. 
Like, shout out to you, fine arts majors. I couldn't do it. Also, you don't have a control Z. I could not live without control Z. <laughs> Can't control Z IRL. That is the least grass touching sentence I think I've ever said. Okay, here we go. We're gonna do the horns once I'm like confident that we're not gonna ruin the brown paint. <laughs> Bless Kit. <laughs> I appreciate. There we go. So, Jelly Bean, the flat colors. <laughs> very shiny, as she is still very liquidy. There we go. Me fix this paintbrush really fast. Okay. I'm thinking about doing a background. I don't know if it's going to ruin everything, though. Be safe, Black Emerald. <laughs> Thank you for coming out. I will hopefully be able to sport a fabulous, professional looking jelly bean painting. <laughs> okay, let's do the horn. Why am I grabbing that? I have paint. The horns are black. I'm just stupid. Can I get away? It appears so, I just have to be very careful. Horn. There you go. Got our little horns for our buddy. <laughs> What's up, Summer? <laughs> no worries, we're just we're in the middle of jelly beaning. I tried to give like little foot, like the little paw marks, and I don't know if it made it worse or not, but uh, here we go. Next update. This is jelly bean so far. We're getting somewhere. Um, next up, I'm going to want to do the, uh, the eyes, and then I'll do the mouth. I will probably grab a second mouth. Yes, a mouth brush. A mouth brush. I'm gonna grab a second paint brush for the eyes, so I can keep this black one for the mouth. But I did just rinse off that. Okay. I could chew off firm. Precious bean. <laughs> Our lovely jelly bean. We open up this one. We use the fucking thing they have provided that I don't, so I don't have to get paint on my hands. You know, like a smart person. There we go. That smell right there, holy shit. This is the glitter gold. Once it actually comes out, there we go. Some glittery gold paint here for Jelly Bean's eyes. Go. This is the new paintbrush.
And we're gonna hope this is dry enough. I'm like, sorry, like hyper, hyper focused on this thing. <laughs> the eyes are a little derpy, which is unfortunate, but I cannot do much about it. <laughs> I feel like some little stars on this boy. While I'm here, might as well use this paintbrush for more stuff. Let's draw some stars. Make it look jelly beans like in the cosmos or something. some little stars this is turning out more like a diamond oh no there we go that's a star that's a star let's go up there and make a star okay like a little one over here bam <laughs> do, 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 do. I'm excited for minecraft again I, I have like minecraft phases like sometimes I'm like really into minecraft and then I'll put it down for like six months we're in the on phase with Minecraft right now. I like Minecraft right now. Oh dear, I've made this star look goofy. It's a star. I'll do like the moon right here. It can be like he's jumping over the moon. <laughs> that can be your little... That's how we make it have like artistic purpose or something. We make jelly bean jump over the moon. <laughs> Cow didn't jump over the moon. My my devil cat did. Hmm. This is a very thin paint, I will say that. Yeah, like the gold is like very liquidy. Like the other acrylics are kind of thick. This is like, this is like painting with pee. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out if I should just splat it. Wouldn't look nice. So I don't think I'm gonna splat it. Oh, this is difficult. <laughs> yeah, the gold the gold paint is kind of making this very difficult. It smells like a chemical chemical foot. Like you took an armpit, you like ran it through like some kind of radioactive isotope, and then put the armpit to my face. I'm legit just like dumping paint on now to try to make it look thicker. <laughs> Sorry, strat, that's our cheat. Yeah, it's kind of working. It's not as neat as it could be, but it is something. I 
I'm like just trying so hard to fix this. <laughs> this is also giving me a strong anxiety about lifting the canvas before this is like 100% fucking dry. Okay, we're kind of there now. Do like some dots. That well versed in radioactive isotopes. <laughs> I mean, sometimes, you know, somebody just says, hey, can you smell this plutonium? And you kind of just have to smell the plutonium because you don't know how to tell them no, so you just smell your stranger's plutonium. Okay, let me do jelly beans smile. Oh, it's gonna be difficult. Okay, that came out nice. I don't want to do the little blushy marks because I'm terrified. <laughs> We're getting somewhere. Our jelly beans so far. Featuring the moon that is like just globs of this fucking paint because it won't stay still. <laughs> little jelly bean. Happy friend. I am now colored. Yes, I, I was going to say cover, but I guess I am also colored technically this paint all over me. <gasps> Big stretch. Okay, we have our jelly bean. Trying to decide if I'd want to do a background. I think I'll go back over with like a background color after this is dried. Because I don't want to mess with this before it's dried. <laughs> I'm scared of that. <laughs> No, oh, I didn't think to set up like a graveyard for things that are drying. Oh no, um... I'm gonna transfer jelly bean here to some parchment paper and put them on the keyboard. <laughs> there. Okay. Jelly bean is on the keyboard and Next up. What do I want to do next? How complicated do I want to be? I don't think I'm talented enough to pull off like anything crazy. Hmm. I could do a Pokemon. I think I want to do a Pokemon. Trying to think about what Pokemon would go with the colors I have out. <laughs> Could I do a centric? Are these centric colors? Hmm. Okay, put that back. Let me look up what a centret looks like. Actually, black and brown Pokemon. Just casually Google black and brown Pokemon and see what pops up. Hmm. Nothing that's quite exact. We could do a zigzagoon. Yeah, we could do a zigzagoon, I think. Let's do a zigzagoon. We're gonna paint a zigzagoon. Fuck it. We're painting zigzagoon. <laughs> that is our next masterpiece, so I don't waste paint. Well, this one wanted to peel off before I even got the lid off. Up, uh, that is a lot of webbing. Will this still come out or is the webbing gonna make a catch?
Uh, it's all over my hand. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? <laughs> why did I do that? Oh my god, why did I do that? Oh god. I might be a bit of an idiot, guys. I might, I might, I might be like a slight moron. <laughs> Toss him out and get a new paper towel. There we go. And now we can start our zigzag. Because I don't want to waste paint, so. <laughs> I think I'm also gonna have a green though. I don't think I'm gonna pour him yet. I think we'll do him like in the grass, you know, like a cute little zigzagoon like peeking out of the bushes. Cause I wanna have some color variety when I'm painting. <laughs> All right. So let us go ahead and sketch out a zigzagoon. That did not like when I tried to do a circle. You look at a picture of a zigzagoon again. Okay, it's like a cute little button nose. It's like the, it's like the bee's eyes. Boop. Boop. I don't like how the sketch is coming out at all. Oh no. And it's really hard to undo sketches here. Let's do our best. Let's just destroy our eraser, you know, just really make it regret being manufactured here. I'm sorry, Eraser. I have a better idea for these Zigzagoon, actually. I have a better idea how to paint them. What I want to do now, actually. Oh god, I forgot how to sketch because it's been so long painting. <laughs> Do like a like a sky shot to like some zigzagoon looking at the sky. I should have picked an easier to draw Pokemon. I don't know why I thought Zigzagoon would be easy to draw. Like, I, I was severely mistaken. These are not easy to draw. I have regrets. <laughs> like a tree here, maybe. Do this. We're making like an artistic zigzagoon rendering now. <laughs> like very much thinking like how to make this pretty and artistic. I think this is where I'll put like. Do I have sense it here? Like, hmm. No, I'm gonna do like. There has to be something they're staring at. I can't just have them staring into the fucking abyss. 
Dude. Jelly Bean went so well, and then I forgot how art works. <laughs> I don't know how art works. I'm suffering. <laughs> we can make a look at the night sky. Okay, we're gonna make a look at the night sky because I have gold out. We are using the colors we have to our advantage. We're making it work. I'm gonna need... Is it the power flicker? Or is that my eyes? Please don't have that be the power flickering. <laughs> I don't want the power to flicker. Here we go. Let's go ahead and open up our buddy the green. I want to use this shade of green because it's going to be all night sky, night time and such. Okay, there we go. A little bit of green. I really feel like a discount Bob Ross sometimes. And here's our happy little green. He's our friend. He's <laughs> our buddy. I am really fucking up screwing this cap back on. Here we go. Let me mute my microphone as I am being stared at. Well, there you go. I don't know about the power, but I just got told dinner plans, and I like dinner. <laughs> that was concerning for a second. Who cares about concerning things, though? We are going to paint some zigzagoons at night. <laughs> Do I want to start with the brown or the... We'll start with the brown for the trees and the zigzagoons. I don't know. I'm going to wait on the zigzagoons, but I will start at the brown for the tree. You're going to start with the tree. And go through the whole process again of, you know, the fact that this brown isn't very pigmented, so we're going to have to go through twice, but... Tree! It's going to be like a summer night. Here we go. Has anybody else tried painting before? Like... I know, like, the obvious answer is probably going to be yes, but, like, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't know how you, like, go about finding this, because personally, I never took art classes until, like, I had one in middle school. That was it. Like, I went to a charter school, but, like, I really only had that one experience, like, as an art class in school. Like, I never took, like, a proper, like, this is a drawing. I took sewing. <gasps> It's like, I, I never had the experience of like, okay, humidity, this is how you don't fuck up painting things. This brown is really working with me right now, and I am loving it. Like, I, I am loving the energy this brown is bringing to the table. <laughs> Just, yes. You go, girl, you keep being pigmented and easy to spread. That, wow, that's a hell of a sentence with no context. <gasps> Fellas, if never, never tell a lady that she's pigmented and easy to spread. You're probably going to get punched in the fucking face. That's your, that, that's your lady's advice from Humidity. <gasps> Her tree is looking a little funky. So I'm gonna mess with his shape. <laughs> What's up, Odin? <laughs> Honestly, painting is, it's really fun. It is very fun. I, I want to do this more. I will, I do need to do more sketchbook streams too. I, I, I've like not had time to properly give to the sketchbook. <laughs> I still really want to fill it out this year, like, like, I, I haven't filled a sketchbook since I was, like, 
I don't know if I've ever filled, filled a sketchbook. In school, it was way easier to doodle stuff, but, like, I never really did sketchbooks. I just doodled on my papers. I want to fill a sketchbook. I want to feel that sense of pride and accomplishment that EA talks about. Except, I don't know, art isn't that pay to win. Art is more pay to win with, like, algorithms. <laughs> Here's that. And we're gonna go up here and start Mr. Branchy Branch. Here we go. I don't know how to draw the most realistic looking tree here, but I'm hoping that through the power of painting random shapes, I can pretend I know how to make a tree. I meant to have two separate branches and I accidentally made the super branch. <laughs> we can fix this. We can fix this. Make this. There we go. There we go. We're making them. Um... We're making them look a little less goofy. And this, let's go ahead and flush him out. What's up, Frotter? How you doing? <laughs> Here we go. Let's go ahead. Do that. Okay. For reference, like our our tree, his branches are looking a little wonky right now, and I'm trying to fix it. <laughs> The zigzagoons will come in time. I'm trying to make the- I'm trying to save our tree. <laughs> We're supposed to be the easy part. <laughs> what did the like, zigzagoon look like again? Okay, so like the tops of their heads were- The tops of their heads were like brown. Like the brown brown. I think I am gonna go ahead and block in parts of our zigzagoons. I'm gonna do my best to make them look nice. <laughs> Bless Odin. <laughs> Honestly, Frodo, I wish I could be a professional artist, but like, I don't know. I feel like I'd like being like a full-time streamer a little more, because I need to talk to people or I go stir-crazy. Honestly, it has been hard with, the, with like, the internship, just adjusting to being in an office of people where I have to not say bad words, because for most of my life, I've only ever worked in kitchens. So, like, I'm not used to the whole professionalism thing. <laughs> and I promise I'm not going in there every day, like, you know, dropping F-bombs and stuff. I'm just kind of... I go in there and I can't say, damn it. And it's, it's very hard. I like the word, damn it. <laughs> That's one of the, I, like, I don't know, it's like if somebody, if, if, it's like if somebody told you one day that you couldn't say the word, uh, fruit anymore, like an apple, like you, you couldn't, like, acknowledge that apples existed. Like, it's, it's ingrained, you know, like, it's like, you, you just, apples do exist, they're a part of your life, and you can't mention the apples, and it's very hard. <laughs> Professional chef. I am... Very adequate line cook. Head chef is just, like really nice though. He's like, oh yeah, knew he when he was coming today. So I I could think plan around like, oh yeah, we have the extra, you know, we have the we have the hands. Like he was him. See, so like everybody honestly was so supportive in that kitchen when I got the internship. Like I really appreciate. Being able to find a kitchen where, like, everybody is so genuinely, like, building each other up and is just kind. I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> I gotta fix this ear a bit. <laughs> this ear is looking kind of thin. 
This zigzagoon's gonna be a bit bigger. Yeah, this, this is this is gonna be a bit of a bigger zigzagoon. I, I went from simple jelly bean to complicated, like still life piece, and it's going interestingly. <laughs> Okay, the feet are all the same, and then we have a middle part that is also brown that I will go ahead and paint, and then the first part of the tail. Here we go. And... I'm like hardcore focused on making this look decent and I really shouldn't because this is the first time I've ever really messed with this medium and like I don't have to have it to be perfect <laughs> but I want it to be perfect <gasps> I I still can't look at waffles I can't do it I moved from one kitchen where like waffles were like an iconic part of it to like a kitchen where like we sell them, but like they're frozen. And I'm I'm still like getting used to, I don't know, seeing waffles and not having a visceral reaction where like a timer for three minutes goes off in my head. That might just be like a permanent complex I've given myself though. <laughs> okay, this is the end of your tail, mister. Trying to make it pointy. These zigzagoons might look a little goofy. But we're trying. <laughs> okay, so there's that. That's the tree. Make the little root there look nicer. The waffle clock is ticking. Listen, 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 listen. If you've never worked in a kitchen, um, because you know, not everybody has the same experience, it's to just to just describe what a lot of these kitchen timers, like professional ones, sound like. It's like a smoke alarm for some of them. Like, honest to God, the one in my current kitchen, it sounds like the fire alarm. Like, it sounds like a fire alarm is going off. It is very jarring. I hate it with a passion. <laughs> spitting up gold no you are ready to make green okay put that there let's get our green locked and loaded <laughs> here we go what's up penny how you doing make sure my paintbrush isn't totally wet here my hands are like covered in paint here yeah like my, my hands are covered in paint it's it's all over my hands <laughs> And let us begin. I'll start with the tree. I'm going to be a little careful, but like we're going to start with the tree. This is one where all I really want to do is mush my paintbrush. God, that loud beeping. My biggest thing that I had to drill into some of my freaking waitresses, I love them to pieces. All my waitresses are like lovely people is the fact that like they would just turn it off and not say a thing to me and i have auditory problems i you, you can't turn it off and not tell me because there's a strong chance my brain physically has not processed it yet and i would be like yo what the fuck because like they would just turn it off and go about their day and i was like you i i genuinely need you to like not do that please <laughs> Trying to... Some of this might not be like the driest yet, so I'm trying to kind of avoid touching the branch too much. Whilst also keeping the texture of the leaves. <gasps> Artist hands. <laughs> Artist hands have lots of paint. Probably a place or two where you actually stabbed yourself with lead. Calluses. Fucking calluses. Doesn't matter what kind of artist you are, if you're a musician, you're, you're gonna have a callus from something. 
I have a callus on the inside of my knuckle on my ring finger on my right hand where I hold pencils. Because I hold a pencil like this. And I rest it on my ring finger on my right hand. And <laughs> that has created quite the callus. <clears throat> Go a little bit further down. I am working so hard to make this look nicer than it has any reason to. <laughs> bless you, Frotter. Fucking bless. <laughs> Actually really soothing just painting leaves. I wish I had layers, but like either way, I feel like it's it's just very soothing to paint leaves like this. Do this. Make this a little closer. Me and my zigzagoon is still alive here. <laughs> oh, I almost did the thing with the fucking palette again. I do not know why I am apparently so determined to knock my paint onto the floor. <laughs> I'm doing like some leaves blowing around in the wind here. I just got some of zigzagoon's tail on me. <laughs> Leaf layer closures the branch. <laughs> I want to like I, I just want to be able to move things around and like draw underneath things and I can't because that's not how you know that's not how physics works. Okay, so here. This is our tree so far, as I struggle desperately to show things on this thing. So we have a tree. And then our little zigzagoons here in the corner. <laughs> it's slightly difficult, but we are we are getting there. And I still want to do like a night sky. I might do it as just a black. You know, use up some more of the black. Makes it look all neat. I don't know if that would look nice though, necessarily. Bless, Frotter. <laughs> there we go. Trying to make sure that I'm getting all the green out of this. I think I've dyed this. I, I, I've, I've dyed this paintbrush green. I've, I've dyed it green. <gasps> it's like I have to just accept the fact that I have dyed this paintbrush. Okay. Now let me get the light yellow that I was going to use for the zigzagoons. Pour that out. And I have to like aggressively jiggle it because it is not wanting to come. Ah! Okay, I got like all of it out there. Not the intended goal, but that is where we are at now. <laughs> Put the lid back on. Okay, so now we have like a fuck ton of this color. This should be fine. And our zigzagoons are looking not quite the driest, but somewhat. Oh, we're gonna see where we land. We're gonna see where we land. <laughs> I'm impatient. We're gonna see what happens. Like being so careful. I think it is gonna mix. I think I have to accept the fact that it's gonna mix paints. kind of mixing if I just like dab it it doesn't really mix let me do the tails first oh I do not like how this looks <laughs> oh dear we are here now and this is what we have been dealt
Oh dear. <laughs> Honestly, all y'all are too nice. All y'all. Ah, to do with y'all, you're too nice. I appreciate you. Let's see here. Try to trying to give them like some texture. But it's hard because yeah, this guy's definitely not dry. <laughs> Well, there's our zigzagoons, for better or for worse. <laughs> They're there. Oh, I forgot about the yellow thing. Oh, I forgot about the yellow thing. Oh, it is like caked onto my flesh. Caked onto my flesh. Okay, go. Go. Bam, bam. Bam. I do apologize again about just like Tuesday and my very last minute sudden vanishment. I, again, like without going too much into it, just everyone just remember to take care of yourselves, you know, just, just take some time for yourself. Don't let your stress levels get super crazy high. Just, just take care of yourself. <laughs> That's like the best advice I can really offer. <laughs> do it. Okay, this is made for green already, so I'm going to use this. There's... I could make this like a... Hmm. Purple or blue? Purple or blue? Purple or blue? Hmm. Purple or blue? I could do... See, that's already kind of blue tinted. I think I'd be better off doing blue. Stoop blue. Blue, 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 blue. I'm gonna mix this with the black. There we go. Clonk. Get some blue in there. There we go. Oh, almost dropped the blue onto my laptop bag. That would have sucked. <laughs> would have fucking sucked. Oh, put that down before I, you know, throw paint everywhere. I keep trying to close these with one hand and it does not work and I need to stop trying to do that. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is the paintbrush. We are going to try and mix these. Although they're acrylic paint, it's probably not going to fucking happen. Just like... Yeah, no, these aren't really mixing. I tried. I tried to mix them. Either way, we're going to have to start painting now. <laughs> it looks like we're going to have a black night sky. <laughs> Sometimes the universe says, no, bitch, you're not mixing with these colors. And that's gonna start making them have a sky. And this is another one where I'm gonna have to come back to it because I want to add stars, but like, not exactly a, it, it, the dry time is just not friendly. <laughs> And then let's go ahead and just get these, go. I wanted it to be like a pretty, like dark blue, but like the only blues I have are very MS paint, <laughs> for lack of a better term. I am gonna go over these leaves though. I didn't like how the leaves came out. So we're just gonna, just gonna, Make our happy accidents go away. Not the leaves in the tree, the leaves that are in the wind. I should probably make that clear. We're, we're keeping the tree leaves, I like how they came out. There we go. 
I'm going to name this one Zigzagoons, Staring into the Abyss. I actually have a Zigzagoon on my desk. I got, like, this... It came out the year I was born, I believe. Like, a little after. No, after. I was born before Zigzagoon was a concept. But, um... <laughs> I have these, uh, this, I have this little zigzagoon on my desk, and, like, the paint was really goofy on it, and I actually spent, like, an afternoon, like, repainting him, or, or her, her name is Wiggles. I don't know why my English has just suddenly decided that it does not want to speak English anymore. Just kidding. this. Probably come a little closer to some of these leaves. Some of these as well. And then zigzagoons. These is going to be harder because I have to make sure I don't... I don't want to touch them, so like I have to be very careful. Bonk. Bonk. There we go. I can like spread some of this out. <laughs> there we go. I realize some of the black is like caked up now. I'm just kind of yeeting it around the canvas a bit since we have extra. <laughs> there we go. This makes me look, this makes it look like the zigzagoons have depression. Uh, take it as a metaphor or something. <laughs> I did not mean for it to look like the walls were closing in on these, you know, wild Pokemon. There we go. We're almost done with this part. Oh, my face is itchy. Oh, a terrible time for my face to be itchy. Oh, no. There. Zigzagoons. They're zigzagging. Okay. I really love, and I want to know the legal battle that it took to be able to use the KISS designs for the Zigzagoons in Alola. <laughs> like, I don't think anybody was expecting that. I think that's hilarious. <laughs> okay, so now that my Zigzagoons are going through their emo phase, let's get the rest of the grass done. Here is my grass paintbrush. Instead of line art, I just, like, aggressively make the colors not touch. <laughs> and now I'm just, like, the goal is to just get as much green down here as possible. Here we go. This surprisingly seems to have taken less time than Jelly Bean did. <laughs> I think it's a jelly bean I was, I don't know, I was going a little harder for perfection with jelly bean in terms of like the details. With this I'm just drawing like the backs, the back parts of a couple zigzagoon and then the tree was the intense part. I goofed that. And then this can be 
has to be apples. My little depressed zigzagoons. <laughs> There we go. All right, I'm gonna give that a second before I even try to pick it up and I'm gonna get these paintbrushes because this is wet. Zigzagoons in Despair, <laughs> that is a perfect name. <gasps> this is Zigzagoons in Despair, 2023. The artistic vision was I tried to mix the black with the blue and it did not take. There we go. There we go. Okay. All right. They're like dyed a certain color, but like, they still seem to be usable. Let me throw this one away. He's at his limit. Now, once this had like, once this has had a day to dry, we're gonna, we're gonna do more with him. <laughs> I was also in despair while painting this. <laughs> Honestly. I just wanted the colors to mix together. Move this out of the way. We have zigzagoons in despair here. We have some zigzagoons. They're looking at the night sky. There's a tree. Yeah. I One of these days I will get like a webcam on a tripod and this will be so much easier. But there we go. There are zigzagoons. <laughs> Bless Odin. I appreciate it. <laughs> You too, Frauder. I am gonna go ahead and transfer this to the place of the drying, where a jelly bean appears to have begun to dry marvelously. As a reminder, here's our little jelly bean jumping over the moon. She's doing real well. She's just drying out. <laughs> I will put her I don't know where I want to put her. I don't want to put her next to the wet zigzagoons because I feel like it's a bad idea. We'll put her up here. This thingy. That can go there, I guess. <laughs> Bless. I'm really happy with how Jelly Bean came out. Jelly Bean came out very nice. <laughs> okay. Oh my neck. That was a that was a fucking crack right there. Oof. Neck, neck, neck. Oof. Okay. Well, I saw it. My painting style is I've never done painting before. <laughs> okay, for my final final act. I have this floppy canvas, which I don't want to try any kind of detailed work on because it is floppy. So we're just going to make a sunset, I guess. <laughs> and that will be my final act this evening. And for this sunset, I am going to take a bunch of these warm colors. And we are going to make a pretty sunset. <laughs> Floppy Sunset. That is totally the name of my next fucking band. Alright guys, get ready for the musical dealings of Floppy Sunset. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> See the acrylic get like it like dries a bit and gets stuck to like the pull tabs on these and have to be very careful. Not in clouds of water. Probably just clouds. I'm gonna go with sunset with clouds. I don't think I will ever have anything go into a museum. 
God help me, it's already scary that, you know, anybody on the internet can just, like, look and see my things. I have a coworker who actually knows I stream. Um, hi, coworker. <laughs> he has popped into a couple now. He does not chat, but I know he is there. <laughs> Memorialized. At the very least, the, the giant digital beast now has copies of the video files of all of my painty paints. Oh, I stand corrected. I did need a second paper plate. Okay. We are on paper plate number two. Move number one there for right now. Fuck it. And let us use paper plate number two to put all of our pretty sunset colors. I'm gonna need this too. And I think I'm gonna want white for a cloud. I don't know if I want white for a cloud. We'll see where we end up first before I open the white. Before we open that up. No, well, let me just go ahead. Be using more than two plates. <laughs> Honestly, I wasn't sure if I'd need to. I was like on the fence about it when I was grabbing my stuff. And then Tech Demon was like, just here, just just take the pile. And I was like, I don't think I need this many. And then I ended up needing this many. <laughs> Look at me. Being proven wrong. I don't really need a lot of each. I'm gonna have to get a second one of these, aren't I? <laughs> And like, it's not the end of the world, but it's like, these definitely don't have a lot of paint. They're, they're enough for like a little kid to paint their dragon and then they're gonna go dry in the closet. I am the little kid, except in my case, I painted a, a devil cat instead of a dragon. Ooh, it's really fun putting these on the thing and like seeing their colors match. I, want to, I will once again point out that these colors do not blend whatsoever. So, like, I'm basically just going to be piling. <laughs> watercolor and oil paint. I want to get the hang of watercolor. I want to learn it. I really want to learn watercolor. I actually have my watercolor pencils because I wasn't sure if I'd get time to do watercolor today. But at this point, I have dinner coming, and we have one more canvas left. <laughs> but, so let us go ahead. I will put this here for a second. And I want a thicker brush. We have this guy here. He's a, he's a thicker brush. And <laughs> we'll bring beret. <laughs> I actually, I had, I wanted to own a beret. I almost got one when I actually visited visited, visited Paris as a teenager. <laughs> oh, let us begin our painting. I'm going to have to hold this like this. Oh, this is satisfying. This is satisfying just to do. This is like, I don't know how to describe the sensation, but like this feels like yes. Oh my god, that's super fun. Bro, I am here for the sensation of just dragging a brush across a canvas. Okay, so there's that. And then... What was I doing? Paint. Water. <laughs> yes, this is like super satisfying. Okay, this is the last paper towel on that roll. Let's let's do it proud. aggressively trying to get this thing to loosen up on its paint. <laughs> These hold paints like aggressively. Come on, buddy. 
You don't need this much paint in you. That should be enough, anyways. I, I am just beret adjacent to this stream. I don't know what to do with this fucking... You're going there. <laughs> That's our purpley red. Next up, we're gonna do our bright red. Oh. And I'm not gonna drop the fucking paint on the floor. Ow, ow, ow. I laughed too hard and you're cramped. <laughs> More red. This is very MS Paint red. Now this has some fucking pigment to it. This guy's got some oomph. Look at him. He is out here like, yes. Some of these, like, they... Some of these I have to use a good amount of paint because they just do not have much pigment. But yeah, it, it is blending very nicely too. Like, pff, shit, this is nice. Yeah, some of these, like, the brown has, like, barely any pigment to it. But, like, this red was like, yes, I will spread. <laughs> Try to get some of this red off here. I don't have to try as hard as I think I do for getting the color off since I'm literally, they're, they're getting blended. <laughs> this is a very satisfying, this is, this is just a satisfying event all around. Here's our orange coming up. He definitely, I have to throw a little extra of him on. His pigment isn't very thick. I have one more orange after this. This is very satisfying to do. <laughs> no details, just throw color on canvas. Gradient background. I'm thinking I'm just going to do a sun on this when it dries. Although we'll see. I don't know. Right now I know that I'm, just, I, I'm basically just throwing down the colors and enjoying the sensation of throwing down colors. <laughs> your input order and I really do <laughs> and then I need to do the last thingy go and that is the very top orange and then I'm gonna try to do the Sun we're gonna see if it like mixes in or not I'll do like some we're, we're gonna see where we land I'm, I'm throwing stuff on there. We're going to see where we land. <laughs> Did. Did. This is just such a satisfying feeling. Like, I don't know, if you if you just want to feel like something satisfying today, go buy like a dollar canvas from your dollar store and just like some cheap acrylics and just have at it. It's very satisfying. Just this. 
a little bit more of them. There you go. Very fun. <laughs> Getting some, getting some colors happening. There we go. Bless Odin. This is just fun. I guess this has just been fun. I want to mix up a little bit of this orange and red. I might ruin everything. I might not. We're going to see how we go. Because this purple is looking a little too aggressive. <laughs> honestly if you ever want to get into art just try making stuff is my best advice um if you don't know where, what to even start to draw fan art very nice and easy way to kind of <laughs> like have an example to go off of Yeah, it's about to be like a dope ass sunset. <laughs> nice messy sunset. That's what I'll call this messy sunset. Yeah, like for me, like when I first started drawing stuff, I was like, it didn't look great when I when I was like little and stuff. But even now, like I am nowhere near like epic artist. But honestly, I just have fun and I make stuff. That there. And I'm going to try to put a sun here at the bottom. Oh, this is a very light color. Oh, this is, this may not show up well. <laughs> Oh, that's an interesting way of it's blending, though. Ooh, that's intriguing. That is very intriguing. It's very intriguing. Interesting. It's obviously like kind of mixing in, but honestly, it's interesting to see what it's doing. So I keep doing it. Yeah, like, I don't know why this mixes so well, but the black and the blue just did not want to fucking do it. But honestly, it looks kind of neat. Like, I'm kind of here for it. <laughs> oh, like clouds. Ooh, you're right, you're right. Let's see, let's see what happens. Let's see what we got here. This is just satisfying to do. <laughs> My cloud has kind of turned into a giant tumor. <laughs> I 
Hmm. Up here. It's the most help. start there. You have a thing. Here is messy sunset. The very messy sunset. <laughs> Which honestly was just satisfying to paint. I don't even care for like, it just, it was just satisfying to paint. <laughs> yeah, so I had no idea what I was doing, but it came out fun. <laughs> Bless y'all. My hands, by the way, just nice and covered in paint. <laughs> Let me go ahead and clean up this brush here. Because we are, are we are far enough along now that I will run over if I try to start something else. <laughs> so I will go ahead and start Starts to clear down this. Thank you guys for coming, seriously. I am going to be doing more Minecraft. I have, like I said, I reignited my... I, I'm in the Minecraft is fun cycle, so we'll be doing more Minecraft. <laughs> this. There we go. I will see you tomorrow for Xenoverse. <laughs> And we are going to go and make our Pokemon buff. And that is my favorite thumbnail I've drawn so far, is that Xenoverse thumbnail. It is amazing to me. <laughs> but for now, peace.